Hi everyone, once again, this is Purple Cruiser Man, and this is my second video, so yay! Today I will be covering some of the basic commands and syntaxes of the Arduino programming language environment. So, um, this is a simple program to make an LED blink that is connected. So, this is a basic command sequence to make an LED blink that is connected to the Arduino board. So what you want to do is you want to take the cathode of the LED, which is the negative part, and connect it to the one of the digital pins that is labeled ground. So, you know, take the negative part of the LED and connect it to the ground pin on the digital side. Then, take the positive side, or as, one of you, as some of you techies say, anode, and connect it to digital pin 13. Some Arduinos already come with an LED attached to it, but if it doesn't, then yeah, you know, just do that. So, the two main things always are void setup and void loop. Void setup is where you initialize all of the pins and everything, and void loop is where you actually play it all out. So, as you can see, since, as some of you might already know, if something is connected to ground, it's automatically got a um, negative voltage flowing through it, so no problem with that. Now, what you want to know, what pin mode, okay, so that's void setup, sorry. Um, uh, here, let me open up a new one. So, pin mode. What this does is this basically defines the pin and what kind and what the pin is supposed to do. Is it output or input? Output meaning is it supposed to send out something? Input is it supposed to receive something? So, here I've set pin third pin mode 13, so pin 13, com, uh, space, all caps, output. So this initializes pin 13 as an output, which is the positive side. Ooh, sorry, and one big main thing. After every line, you want to put a semicolon. This tells the Arduino processor that this line is finished and we can move on to the next line. So, as I was saying, initialize pin mode 13 as output. And as you can see here in void setup, I put these two little things here that's just supposed to be there and then I put this one see that little line right there that one and then this one that is basically the sequence or the main body of the void setup so you always want to put that because that tells the void setup what I'm setting up or what I'm initializing then after we put a closing of uh, parentheses here enter once and then we type in void loop once again with those two little parentheses right here and then a space and then that same thing as last time this is once again the body of the void loop that tells the that tells void loop what you're supposed to do and now let's move on to the digital write command digital capital w write what the digital write command does is as you can see here it's labeled digital so that means it's set to the digital pins and write basically means output I mean digital write something something if you were to write analog write that would give the analog write the analog pins uh, um, a output so here let's go back over here digital write so the syntax for the digital write command is you write digital write parentheses your pin in this case it's pin 13 a comma a space and then this you can it can be high low anything here in this case it is a high because um well as some of you may know where uh, as I stated before the negative pin of the LED is connected to ground and then the positive is connected to pin 13 so in the programming environment and when something gets set to high it's basically set to a one or full voltage if it's set to low it's set to zero or nothing just make it a negative so when I say digital write 13 high I'm setting out I'm giving out 5 volts to the LED which basically makes it light up and then once again you put the closing parentheses and the semicolon click enter and go to and type in delay what the delay command does is obviously it's quite simple is it tells the Arduino to wait wait for a certain amount of time and in this case delay well an Arduino in this specific command delay is 
in milliseconds. It's not in seconds, it's in milliseconds. So if I wrote delay 500, that means wait for half a second. So once again, the syntax is delay, parentheses, whatever, how much ever time wait you want. You guys can change it. I just put 500 to make it simple. Another parentheses and a semicolon. So now, so far, we've reached to, so now, so far, this is what we have. The pin mode set, pin mode 13 and output, the, in the void loop, make it pin 13 high for 5 volts, and then wait for half a second and do nothing. And then, click enter, and once again, type in digital write. This time, we will turn the positive lead of the LED, or well, we'll basically cut off the voltage from there. So, which makes the LED, in this case, blink, sort of. Type in digital write with the parentheses 13, because once again, remember this is pin 13 for the positive lead, comma, space, low. As I explained before, low means zero, so no voltage. And then parentheses, semicolon. Then once again, type in delay. Same syntax as before, this one. You can just control copy or type it again. Once again, we're telling the Arduino to wait for half a second. Now, just put this closing parentheses here. So, so far this is what we have. Void setup, pin mode 13 output. Set pin mode 13 as an output, and then close it. We go to void loop. Void loop. We have opening statement. Digital write 13 high. Turn the LED on. Delay for 500. Wait half a second. Digital write 13 low. Turn the LED off. And then del and wait for another 5 Sorry, wait for a half a second. And in void loop, it constantly it's constantly looping this, so it's playing it over and over again. One thing I forgot to tell you guys, void setup only goes once. So it only plays out the void setup once, whereas it whereas it plays void loop again and again and again. For and um, for infinite infinity infinite times. So what this basically is doing is we're making the LED blink. So, as you can see, digital write 13 high, on, wait, off, wait, on, wait, off. So, if you, so, if, and then, if you upload that to the board, you'll see how the LED blinks. So, let's save this, control S, and I've already saved this, and, and I labeled it blink. You can save it to any folder you want, and then click Control R. What Control R does is it compiles the program and makes sure all of the syntaxes are right and nothing is wrong. In this case, as you can see, it's done compiling and everything is right. And then click Control U to upload it. My uh, Arduino isn't connected right now, but that's what you do. Click Control U to upload it. And it should work. It will. Don't worry. So that is the basics, some of the basic syntaxes for the Arduino. Hope you guys like it. I am open to suggestions, comments, nice comments, and if I made a mistake, please tell me in the comment section. Thank you for watching.